on the road again. I'm gonna learn how to kill people on the road again. I'm gonna have fun making some music with my friends. Starting my bloodletting career on the road again. Okay, let's see. I think we gotta go up, around, upside down, through the wilderness. And the past phrase was, silence my brother. I think it was sanguine my brother in oblivion. More, more little backwater references there. Random black pond. <sighs> oh, hey, look, this looks familiar. Poke. What is the music of life? Um. Okay. Can I? Can I? Can I answer? Oh, there we go. Took it a second. Uh. Um. The loot. No drums. Screaming. Some kind of choir with chanting. Silence. Yay! Okie dokie. So we're in the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary, it appears. Um, it's not as open as the other one was, as far as I know. Ooh, shrouded shoes. Shrouded hood, shrouded robe. Look at all this. It's all different colors, too. Ah, at last. I hope you found the place alright. Yep. So what happens now? Well, what happens now is you start your new life in the Dark Brotherhood. You're part of the family, after all. This, as you can see, is our sanctuary. You won't find a safer place in all of Skyrim. So get comfortable. Remain silent. Mm. Yes, the silence suits you. Gives you an air of mystery. Now. Down to business. I'm arranging a job for you. But in the meantime, go talk to Nazir. He may have some smaller contracts to tide you over. Soon, the Night Mother will arrive. And things around here are sure to get even more interesting. Ah, but one last thing. A welcome home present. The armor of the Dark Brotherhood. May it serve you well in all your endeavors. I was waiting for this part. Curious to see if it's uh, similar or different. And who is the Night Mother? And the Conjuring? And killing someone? Really? Tell me about yourself. No. Sure Don't care. Introduce yourself to your new family members. They're all very eager to meet you. I shall do so. Okay. So let's go ahead and equip our new armor, just uh, for the heck of it, and see what we're working with here. We got shredded armor, poison resistance, move silently, bows do 20% more damage, backstab does double damage. Holy crap. Let's see if we got any armor bonuses for wearing all of this. Do we have any armor bonuses? I'm not looking at the right thing, that probably would not help me too much. Uh, no, it appears to be just everything in particular just sort of runs together. Okay, so that's the way the new armor looks. Sort of derpy, if you ask me. Let's see if we can kind of customize that with our current set here. Um, I want to keep uh, the hood, probably not so much, even though like the hood looks really badass. Um, the gloves, the boots don't really matter. Let's see, which pieces of this was I not using very much? Um, I definitely want to keep the cowl because that's a killer effect. Actually, maybe all of this would be nah, let's just use all of it. Just for just for the sake of just for the sake of it. I'm afraid I don't have a primary contract for you yet. Alright. Oh, what? You're such a pretty little girl. Would the sweetie like a sweetie? Oh yes, how about some chocolate? Oh yes, please, kind sir. My mama and papa left me all alone, and I'm 
so very hungry. I know a shortcut to the candy shop through this alley. Oh, yeah, very good, very good. Mine's dark down here. Oh, but you're so beautiful, such a lovely smile. Your teeth! No! <laughs> no bad, bad, but you are so wicked. What about you, Festus? How about that last con- What the hell? Oh, yes, please, old man. Regale us with your tales of wizardry. Ah, oh, the young and stupid. Always mocking the experienced and brilliant. My contract went very well, I'll have you know. Tried a new spell. Little something I've been working on in my spare time. Came this close to turning that priest inside out. Damn messy. And what of your latest, Arnbjorn? Something about a Khajiit. Merchant, was it? Oh, a big doggy chasing a little kitty. How adorable. <laughs> I don't know who this little girl is, but she's creepy as heck. Um, don't worry, I've noticed the words of power on the board over here. I'll go ahead and grab those. Kill marked for death. Ooh. So I guess that's a custom word just for being in the Dark Brotherhood or something like that. I think I'm gonna go ahead and equip that. That sounds cool. Shouts. Uh, marked for. I have a dragon soul to unlock the thing too. I'm gonna go ahead and unlock that, and I guess we'll use it. Death mark some people. That sounds fun. All right, so let's meet everyone down here in a little bit more detail. See what is going on here. First, this red guard guy, because he's got the crazy little arrow over his head. So you're the newest member of our dwindling, dysfunctional little family. I've heard quite a bit about you. Have you now? Remain silent. Ah, going for the mysterious and brooding thing, huh? That may work for your targets. But you'll find I'm not so easily impressed. Astrid said you'd have Did some work for me. Well, as it turns out, there are a few lingering contracts we haven't had the chance to complete just yet. And more, dribbling in from time to time. I'll assign them to you as they become available, to be completed at your leisure. Sounds simple enough. It is. These aren't particularly glamorous assassinations, I'll be honest. Don't pay much either. But they'll keep you busy. Just do them as you're able. There's no real time limit. The targets aren't going anywhere. You can turn each one in as it's completed, or wait and turn in the whole group when all the targets have been eliminated. Whichever works for you. Dang. Okay, I guess I'm ready for the first set. Well then. Let's get started. I've got three available right now. Holy crap. Your targets are the beggar Narfi, an ex-miller named Enodius Papias, and Baytilde, a mind boss. When you've completed all those, we'll see if I might have some more. Well, crap. Go on now. Man, they're putting me to work. Right off the bat, I guess killing is in high business in this place. When you started off in a Oblivion, it's like, um, we'll just have this one guy, and like, no, no, these people just throw about ten people at you to start off. Insane. Okay. Um, let's go talk to the other buddies. Let's see where they're at. Uh, around here. Somewhere. I want to talk to you, actually. There you are. Astrid's told me all about you. Heard she pulled the old choose-your-victim gag with you. Huh. I'd love that one. Oh, she's a vampire. You're going to love it here. We have a lot of fun, and we look out for each other, just like any family. Jeez. <laughs> okay. I'm just a little girl. The Dark Brotherhood killed my mama and papa, and then they took me captive. Please, please help me. <laughs> Rather convincing, don't you think? In truth, I'm no more a little girl than you are. I was once, of course, 300 years ago. Vampirism tends to keep one remarkably 
That's what I figured. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, so she's the guild vampire. Okay, that's that's good. That's uh that's awesome. All right, I'm going to take all this stuff, don't mind me. Um Sweet. Oh, I got to level up from that. Awesome.